She's in rough shape. It's she, There's a lot of swelling. She's got a lot of broken bones. Sarah Wilmis rushed to University Hospital Sunday night, even beating the helicopter flying her best friend, desperate to be by her side. 32-year-old Tiffany LaPointe was hit by a car while crossing the street. On her way to Salem's Blue River Baptist Church for evening services. Police say the driver, Justin Cartwright, was driving under the influence. It knocked the wind out of everybody. It really did to know that this was a preventable thing. And she, I mean, she was inches away from being across the street. You know, uh, a sober driver might have swerved and missed her completely. LaPointe is a mother of two and stepmom to who she calls bonus kids. Her family says she was going to church for the first time when she was hit. She was crossing the road somewhere in this area. Pastor Brad Moore was the one who called 911. His congregation canceled services that night, but returned Monday for a prayer vigil. We hope for complete healing and that she gets to come back and um, see the people that who have loved her so much, even many of whom don't even yet know her. LaPointe, a nurse, is now relying on a team of doctors and nurses who are monitoring her care in the ICU at University Hospital. But Wilmis says her friend of more than two decades has something else, something she was just beginning to explore on Sunday, and that's faith. The injuries that she had, I don't, I, I mean, it's a miracle that she's here. You know, so I have no doubt we can get another miracle and get her out of the hospital. And because of the impact of Sunday night's crash, Tiffany LaPointe was actually thrown several yards. And as a result, as you just heard, Rick Vicky, she has multiple broken bones. But I can tell you what else she has tonight. She has friends and family by her side. And they tell me plenty of prayer warriors. Reporting live for you tonight out University Hospital, I'm Lauren Adams, WLKY News.